passion. Just how exciting is it, is it to be here in San Francisco? Of course, the team doing so well again. Oh, it's just amazing. And it's even more exciting to have Eric back in California. So it's convenient and back in his old stomping grounds and back on bleachers again. <laughs> Eric talks about you so much. Just how difficult was it on your end with the craziness in our world the last two years that you haven't been able to, to make your way out to Fayetteville? Oh, I know. I haven't missed a game on TV, though. So um, it was first COVID and then the Omicron and in between a knee replacement. So it's been a crazy time. And um, I'm so excited for the game. It'll be wonderful. What, what, are, what were the emotions like? Of course, yeah, you, you wouldn't miss a game, but not being able to, to be there, you know, as much as you, you may have liked with everything going on. Was that hard or was it, you know, okay with how much you guys, you guys talk? Oh, no, it was terrible. And I text after every game and um, I had four TVs going at all times because I kind of traveled from one room to another, rearranging furniture or doing a load of laundry or something. So you were like everyone else in your family, it sounds like. You're an anxious, nervous <laughs> game watcher when it's when it's all happening. Yes, except the last game, it was quite curious. It was like a calm. Mm -hmm. I just knew he had it. What, what's it been like for you to watch all the success, not only this year, but last year and the year before, what he's done with this Arkansas program? I mean, he's the mayor of Fayetteville. He really oh, is. Well. It's been very exciting, and I think it's a really happy time um, for him because he's teaching again, and I think it's a different environment than it was, say, in San Francisco with the pros. And I think he loves seeing these kids go on to bigger and better things. So, no, I, I'm just so proud. What were your emotions when you found out the team was going to be in San Francisco and you could, could get down here? Yes. <laughs> I just, first I hoped they were going to be um, in San Diego for that round. But uh, when that didn't happen, I did not shuffle off to Buffalo. So here I am and uh, it's, it's going to be great. I think you had your Arkansas fame last year with the, uh, of course, the handwritten note and you making your way on the SEC network. Is that something you guys still do? The uh, handwritten notes or at least on the phone talking about what went right, what went wrong with each game? We do talk on the phone or we text after every game, every single game. And then... Are the, you critical? Um, sometimes I'll say things that aren't <laughs> quite wonderful. <laughs> But um, no, I'm not, I try not to be very critical. And um, I, I wouldn't begin to think about knowing the X and O's the way he does. So um, try to be positive. What do you think it's gonna be like tomorrow when you're in the stands watching him do his, watching him do his thing on, on the biggest stage? I think it's gonna be exciting and um, fulfilling and being very, very proud.